Above all, this is a school which is very happy, very friendly and very family orientated. And we feature very much and work towards a situation where it's childhood and education rather than education and childhood. If they're happy and settled, they're going to perform in whatever activities they take place, whether that's in or outside the classroom. It might be out on the sports field, it might be musical, it might be artistic, it might be in design technology. We'll look for that, we'll develop that. That'll build his or her confidence up and off they go. And all of a sudden, they find themselves sparking in the subjects they thought they weren't very good at because the confidence is being built elsewhere. That's what we're about. Playsmore Prep School is all about finding the needs and the strengths of the child. So we look for what they're really good at, but also support um, where they might have some specific weaknesses. From year three onwards, they're going to do art in an art studio. They'll have time in the workshops. They'll have three or four game sessions a week, which include working in the sports hall. So that means swimming, climbing, trampolining, badminton, squash. Uh, the game sessions are regular as well, so they're going to be out there playing rugby or cricket, or whatever the season is, three or four times a week, as well as a marvellous astroturf to play hockey and tennis on. We chose Claysmore Prep School because of the beautiful surroundings here. Um, and all we have to do is, is look outside and, and see the, the fields and the hill which is beautiful. The facilities here are fantastic for them and my middle son in particular who's quite sporty you know he can really uh, stretch out literally stretch out and he's so much happier and I think they're thinking about the children and how to get the best out of them. They've got an opportunity for continuity and change. The continuity for them is that they're going to move to the senior school and 85% of them will move on to the senior school. So they're maintaining their friendships that they've established here over however long they've been here, but they've also got the opportunity to make new friendships. And that's very important. It almost makes that seamless transition from year eight to year nine. We're very supportive and we foster confidence in the children. It's the whole package. It's the support that is in the classroom. It's the differentiation in the classroom. They're gaining independence in a supportive way. Uh, there's a boarding team on each night of six people. Two teachers, a matron, a nursing sister, and usually two or three GAP students. Uh, and they're Im immensely supportive and will guide the children in gaining that independence. And it's all those things coming together which says so much about Claysman. I would say it's one large, happy family. You don't go anywhere without seeing smiles on faces, be it teachers or the pupils. Everybody's confident and happy and it's a fantastic place to be. We're all very proud, collectively as a staff, of what we achieve at the end of year eight. It's not actually so much about the grades collectively, it's about the grades of that individual child. It's how they progress individually, which is an important thing, and they all do very well. Mm -hmm.